Craig, Fire Prevention Week is coming up. What's that about? Fire Prevention Week runs from the 10th to the 15th uh, next week. Um, it's uh, a national uh, uh, verification that we should be ha we should have fire safety in our homes, in our business places, and uh, and pretty much everywhere. Uh, we have to remind people that it's important to have smoke detection in their dwellings, especially in their bedrooms. That's very important. Uh, we have to remember that um, uh, probably 50 percent of firefighter fire deaths occur in homes that do not have smoke detectors still in this day and age. And we've been preaching smoke detection for quite a few years now. So we still find quite a few instances where there is no smoke detection. The theme of this year's campaign is don't wait, check the date. Tell us about that. Uh, this year we we're recommending that we, uh, you check the date on the back of your detector, whether it's a carbon monoxide detector or a smoke detector. It has a manufacturer's date that it was manufactured. Uh, ten years from that date, the device should be uh, re, uh, thrown away and you should purchase a new one. And what about changing the batteries? Changing the batteries in a normal smoke detector is uh, twice a year. Uh, we recommend that you change the batteries when you change the clocks. So it would be every fall and every spring you should change the batteries in a average uh, home smoke detector. What about the new uh, detectors that have lithium batteries that last for 10 years? How do you check those, make sure that they're still working, other than the date? The 10-year lithium batteries are designed to uh, last for 10 years, and then it, uh, it's, it's fairly simple. You just throw the device away because it's at its expiration date. To test those, they recommend that you test those once a month, and you press the button on, the, on them, the test button, and it should go off uh, in a normal fashion. What are the rules or regulations for smoke detectors in private homes? Private homes are, are uh, in the city of Portland are uh, required to have hardwired smoke detectors in each bedroom and uh, in a common area in each, uh, in each house. So it should be in a living room or a hallway or something like that, but there should be one in every bedroom, should be one in the basement, at least one in the basement, and one in a common area in the home. They're also required to have carbon monoxide detectors in the basement and in common areas such as a uh, living area or a hallway, carbon monoxide. If people have questions about smoke detectors or want more information, where can they call? They can call 874-8400 to our fire headquarters and we can be referred to fire prevention for uh, any uh, detector questions, certainly.